the young british boy john newton was born and raised in england he lost his mother at a young age of 6 and he got himself into many bad activities we are told that he served as a captain in slave ships and he was an investor into the ancient 18th century slave trade across africa and other asian countries perhaps he took advantage of some slave boys and girls and sexually exploited them but later in his life john newton surrendered his life to jesus this horrible sinner surrendered his life to jesus after reading a book called the imitation of christ at 39 john newton became a minister in england and served in different counties between oxford and cambridge today if you go standing next to the cemetery of john newton is the word that is written john newton clerk once an infidel and libertine indulging in sensual pleasures that's the meaning of that a servant of slaves of africa was by the rich mercy of the lord and savior christ preserved restored pardoned and appointed to preach the faith he had long labored to destroy amazing grace and he penned down this song amazing grace how sweet the sound that saved a wretch like me i once was lost but now i am found i was blind but now i see it was grace that taught my heart to fear and grace my fears relieved how precious did that grace appear the hour i first believed he goes on to say the lord has promised good to me his word and hope secures he will my shield and portion be as long as life and yours if there is anybody who is living the old lifestyle i don't want you to stand up online or in house the bible says that you are living a dead life under the power of satan the influence of the world and living like an animal in sensuality god is asking you give your life to jesus trust in him as the one who has mercy over you and he can give you eternal life just say a prayer the lord jesus i know i am a sinner i live among sinners i am living among the dead thank you for jesus i believe you as my lord and my savior accept me as your child make that prayer right now get to a holy bible and start reading and god will give you that new life in the lord jesus christ